The Arizona Cardinals added another cornerback today when they were awarded Javelin Guidry off of waivers from the New York Jets. In this video, I'm gonna tell you about Guidry and how he fits with the Cardinals. Guidry is a 24 year old cornerback who played collegiately at Utah. He's five foot nine, 193 pounds and signed with the New York Jets in 2020 after going undrafted. When you look at Guidry's athleticism, you see that he is an exceptional athlete, both in terms of speed and strength. His 429 40 yard dash is exceptional. He is somewhat undersized, but makes up for some of that with strength. But coming out of college, his biggest drawbacks had to do with length and things like play recognition. While there's nothing that can do about his arm length, things like play recognition and his ability to recognize routes are the kinds of things that can be worked on with coaching and repetition. And he does have a reputation as someone who works hard to improve his game. And apparently that hard work paid off. As an undrafted free agent, he managed to stick with the Jets. And in 2020, he played in 11 games recording 22 tackles and no interceptions. And in 2021, he played in 17 games with 48 tackles and zero interceptions. And when you look at his PFF grades, you see that his rookie season was actually quite impressive. Now, he only played 172 snaps, so he was a part-time player, but his defensive grade of 73.1 his tackling grade of 76.7 and his coverage grade of 76.5 were all outstanding for a rookie, especially considered that he went undrafted. Now, unfortunately, in his second season, 2021, while his snaps did go up, his PFF grades unfortunately went down. His defensive grade dropped to 55.9, his tackling grade dropped to 67.5, though that's still quite respectable for a cornerback, and his coverage grade dropped to 56.8. Now, it is worth noting that in his second year, he was playing more outside cornerback than he had in his first year. In his rookie season, he played 132 snaps in the slot, and only seven outside. But in his second year, he played 122 snaps in the slot, and 247 snaps at outside cornerback. It seems plausible that the reason his grades went down is he's probably not best suited to play outside, much like we saw at Byron Murphy Jr. Murphy has graded much better when he's been allowed to play primarily in the slot. So what this suggests is that Guidry, although he is capable of playing both outside and in the slot, is probably better suited as a slot cornerback. But altogether, I think Guidry is a nice pickup for the Cardinals. He's very athletic, with blazing speed, 4.29 40-yard dash. He's a willing tackler and has graded well in the NFL at tackling. He's got experience playing at the NFL level and has shown an ability to play at a high level. When you have someone this athletic, who's known as a hard worker, who's shown he can play in the NFL, that's a player I don't mind bringing on as someone to develop and has the experience to be a depth player for this team. I'd expect him to be the fourth cornerback, someone who only comes in in case of injury and as a backup. But altogether, this is the kind of player you'd like to have as your fourth quarterback. Someone who has the potential to develop into more, but if you need them to play, they've shown they can play at an NFL level. While fans might not be excited about the cornerback room at this point, when you look at adding Trayvon Mullen as they did yesterday, with Byron Murphy Jr., Marco Wilson, Antonio Hamilton, and now Javelin Guidry, this cornerback room is a lot better than it was two days ago. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time on The Cardinal Room.